Hello, welcome back to this channel, welcome to the vlog. I want to start vlogging again and so let's start today. Why not today? Why not? I am working from home, today is a Monday, I just had lunch and I'm back to my little home office here in my bedroom. So we are vlogging this week, I plan to vlog, I don't know, Monday to Friday? I'm not sure yet. I guess you will have to watch until the end to find out. I am home alone now and I am taking one of those everything and all showers. You know, you know those ones? I've seen a few shorts on this, the ones that you end up feeling like you just had like one hour cardio and strength training at the gym. Let me show you, since the last time you were in this bedroom, things are a bit different. I don't know if you remember uh, how the bedroom was, but it was in like shades of grayish blue, it was really clean and I really wanted to give like a more earthy uh, tone to the bedroom, so I looked up some pictures at Pinterest and so we have a few new th things. So we have this cute lamp, we have the same um, picture frames over there, we bought these uh, pillow covers, mustard yellow, uh, we have this, um, how do you say, I don't really remember how you call this, uh, like, sh like, uh, I don't even know in Portuguese now that I think about it, it's like, this is not the, the ooh, wait, 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 capa de dragon. A duvet cover. How on earth was I going to remember that whatever? So, we got this duvet cover, which has this... You, you see? These leaves? I, my, I have new socks and they are just losing, they are shedding everywhere. God damn it. Um, it has these leaves, so really natural look, but it's really mm, not in your face, you know? It's really discreet. We already had this and this. Psyduck is new and is already missing some hair. This was Baloo. We got this from, I think it was Ikea. This was not Ikea, uh, but I don't remember the name of the store. This is also not new. This thingy was on this side before. But now I have my little home office here. This was in the living room, this desk. Now it's in our bedroom. We have my Calathea, which is still alive. Woohoo! Uh, Monstera, alive but sad. <laughs> and yeah, we have this here now. Uh, still this plant, money plant, whatever, alive as well, a bit sad, but yeah. And we got these curtains. These are definitely from Ikea. This was actually a gift from the company where my boyfriend works. Looking at how I look right now, one would think that I am ready to go to bed, but I'm not. <laughs> it's 10.40 p.m. now. We are still gonna go outside to walk the dogs and I still have to like blow dryish my hair because I don't like to go to bed with my hair wet. I'm probably going to go outside on my pajamas, although I'm not sleeping with this. I've been wearing these pajamas to just lounge around the house. I did this last week because I couldn't care less. I just threw on a winter coat, some sneakers and I went outside. I just wanted to share with you guys. I found this body lotion from Johnson's. I'm that person that's really lazy to apply body lotion after uh, showering, but this one I don't know. I 
I just love this. It's really easy to apply. It's not very thick. This actually reminds me of yogurt in terms of texture and it smells so good, so fresh. I really do recommend this. I have also been using this for my eyes. It's a 3-in-1 anti-irritation care very, for very dry, irritated to atopic sensitive eyelids because my eyelids were basically... they were really bad. They were like really, really, really dry to the point of... you could see it. So I went to the pharmacy and they recommended this and my eyelids were terrible and on the first day of me using this they were back to normal. So now I've been using this every night. Sometimes I apply it also in the morning, other times not, but it's good. I don't know why my eyes were that way. Uh, the lady at the pharmacy said it could be due to stress, which makes sense. And um, also like a poor immune system, a weakened immune system can cause that. I don't know, maybe a bit of both, but it's really good. For my lips I use Vaseline. I use this every night. I used to use like a lip balm from Labello and it was terrible because I had to be constantly reapplying it. Otherwise my lips would be dry and it would they would hurt. And ever since I uh, changed to Vaseline every night, my lips have never been so hydrated and I don't feel like this dependency on Vaseline. Oh shit. Idea. I just wanted a little bit for my hands. Do you guys do this too in these colder months? I always tuck in my pajamas into some socks, just normal socks. I don't have to be winter thick socks, you know. And if I don't do this, I will not sleep as well. That's good. Anyway, just wanted to show you guys the book that I'm reading now. This is something that I love to do and so I want to talk more about in this channel. I'm reading the second part of Aruki Murakami's... I'll just say this in English... Killing Commendatore, Volume 2. I really like the first book, but it really leaves you hanging in there. You don't get any closure from the first book. So I immediately, my boyfriend gifted me the first one and I immediately got the second one because I really want to know how this story will unroll. If you haven't read Aruki Murakami, I really, really recommend. He is one of my favorite authors. So I'm going to get to sleep now and we'll continue with the vlog tomorrow. See you there. Thank you.